multi-touch gestures have become a convenient and intuitive way for users to interact with their iPhones. However, if you're experiencing issues with multi-touch gestures on your iPhone, it can be frustrating and make your device less functional. In this video, we will show you what to do if your iPhone no longer responds to multi-touch gestures or commands. But before moving on, please take a moment to like and share our video. This will help us reach more people who may be facing issues with their device. All right, now let's continue. Here's what you can do. First solution, restart your iPhone. Restarting your iPhone is important when experiencing issues with multi-touch gestures because it clears the device's memory and closes any problematic apps or processes that may be causing the issue. This simple step often resolves the problem and is the easiest and fastest solution to try before moving on to other troubleshooting steps. To restart your iPhone, press and hold the power button and either of the volume keys until the slide to power off slider appears. Slide the slider to turn off your iPhone, wait a few seconds, and then press and hold the power button again until the Apple logo appears. After doing that, try to see if the problem is fixed. If not, move on to the next solution. Second solution, clean the screen. Cleaning your screen is important when experiencing issues with multi-touch gestures because dirt or debris on the screen can interfere with the touch sensors and prevent them from working properly. By cleaning your screen, you can ensure that your iPhone is able to accurately detect your touch inputs and enable the multi-touch gestures. Use a microfiber cloth to gently wipe the screen. If the screen is still dirty, lightly dampen the cloth with alcohol. Wipe the screen again with the damp cloth, being careful not to get any moisture in the ports or buttons. Dry the screen with a dry, lint-free cloth. If this doesn't fix the problem either, try the next solution. Third solution, check for a firmware update. Updating your software is important when experiencing issues with multi-touch gestures because it ensures that your iPhone has the latest bug fixes and improvements that can address any known issues with the multi-touch gestures. Sometimes issues with multi-touch gestures may be caused by software bugs or glitches that can be fixed by updating to the latest version of iOS. To check for an update, launch the Settings app. Tap General and select Software Update. If there's an update available, download and install it. Most of the time, if the problem is with the firmware, this procedure would be enough to fix it. Fourth solution, reset all settings. Resetting all settings is important because it erases any incorrect or outdated settings on your iPhone, which can fix underlying software issues that may be causing problems with multi-touch gestures. However, resetting all settings will erase all personalized settings and preferences, so it should be used as a last resort after trying other troubleshooting steps. To do so, just launch the Settings app once again and tap General. Scroll down and tap Transfer or Reset iPhone. Tap Reset to reveal the options and then select Reset All Settings. Enter your security lock and then proceed with the settings reset. When the reset is complete, your iPhone will reboot. After doing that, the device should work normally. We hope this guide can help you. Thanks for watching.